Why does your fart smell? Hey everyone, and welcome to our video about why your farts smell. If you've ever wondered why the air clears when you pass gas, then this video is for you. In this video, we'll be discussing the reasons why farts smell and what makes them particularly unpleasant. Farts are a natural part of the digestive process, and everyone produces them. But why do some farts smell worse than others? The answer lies in the composition of the gas that makes up the fart. Farts are made up of gases like hydrogen, methane, carbon dioxide, and nitrogen. However, the presence of other gases like hydrogen sulfide and mercaptans is what makes farts particularly stinky. Hydrogen sulfide is a gas that smells like rotten eggs and is commonly found in flatulence. This gas is produced when the body breaks down sulfur-containing foods like broccoli, eggs, and meat. The more sulfur-containing foods you eat, the more hydrogen sulfide your body produces and the more pungent your farts will smell. Upset Stomach Apart from the foods you eat, other factors like digestion, gut bacteria, and hydration levels can also affect the odor of your farts. For example, if you have an upset stomach, your farts may smell particularly bad due to the increased production of hydrogen sulfide. Additionally, the bacteria in your gut can play a crucial role in determining the odor of your farts. Some people have a more particular type of bacteria that produces foul-smelling gases than others, which means that their farts will be more pungent. Dehydration Dehydration can also cause your farts to smell more unpleasant. When you're dehydrated, your body concentrates the waste products in your urine and feces, which can make your farts smell worse. Broccoli and Eggs Mercaptans are another type of gas that can make your farts smell terrible. These gases contain sulfur and are commonly found in foods like cauliflower, cabbage, and Brussels sprouts. Digestion and Absorption of Food Digestion and absorption of food are key factors in the production of gas and the odor of farts. When food is not properly broken down in the small intestine, it passes into the large intestine where it's fermented by bacteria. This process produces gas which can cause bloating, discomfort, and flatulence. The type of food consumed also affects the odor of the gas produced. For example, sulfur-containing foods like eggs and broccoli can lead to the production of hydrogen sulfide, which has a strong odor. Gut Bacteria The type and amount of gut bacteria also influence the odor of farts. The human intestine contains trillions of bacteria which help in the breakdown and absorption of nutrients. Certain bacteria produce gases that are responsible for the odor of farts. For example, Methanol Brevibacter smithii is a common gut bacterium that converts hydrogen and carbon dioxide into methane which is odorless. However, some gut bacteria produce gases that have a strong odor, such as hydrogen sulfide. Medical Conditions In some cases, the smell of farts can indicate an underlying medical condition. For example, people with a lactose intolerant cannot digest lactose properly, which can lead to the production of excess gas and the odor of farts. Inflammatory bowel disease, or IBD, such as Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis, can also cause flatulence and foul-smelling farts. These conditions can damage the lining of the intestine, leading to increased gas production. Certain medical conditions can cause the production of foul-smelling gas. For example, gastroesophageal reflux disease, or GERD, can cause the stomach acid to flow back into the esophagus, leading to the production of sulfuric gas. Similarly, small intestine bacterial overgrowth, or SIBO, can cause an overgrowth of bacteria in the gut, leading to the production of more gas. Chemical Composition of Farts As explained earlier, farts are made up of a mixture of gases. These gases include nitrogen, carbon dioxide, methane, and hydrogen, which are odorless. However, when these gases mix with trace amounts of other gases like hydrogen sulfide, ammonia, and mercaptans, they can produce an unpleasant odor. Hydrogen sulfide in particular is responsible for the strong, rotten egg-like smell associated with farts. This gas is produced when the body breaks down amino acids in certain foods like meat and cruciferous vegetables. Health Implications of Foul-Smelling Farts while occasional foul-smelling farts are usually nothing to worry about, persistent and unusually smelly farts could be a sign of an underlying health problem. Some conditions that can cause foul-smelling gas include Lactose intolerance If your body can't break down lactose, the sugar found in milk and other dairy products, it can lead to the production of more hydrogen sulfide in the gut. Celiac disease This autoimmune disorder causes the body to react to gluten, a protein found in wheat, barley, and rye which can cause malabsorption of nutrients and lead to smelly farts. 
Irritable Bowel Syndrome, or IBS. This condition can cause digestive problems like gas, bloating, and changes in bowel movements, which can lead to more pungent farts. Inflammatory Bowel Disease, or IBD. This condition causes inflammation in the digestive tract and can result in the production of more foul-smelling gas. Tips to reduce foul-smelling farts. If you're concerned about the smell of your farts, there are some steps you can take in order to reduce the odor. These include eating a well-balanced diet that includes plenty of fruits and vegetables, drinking plenty of water to stay hydrated, avoid foods that are high in sulfur like meat, eggs, and cruciferous vegetables, taking probiotics or eating fermented foods like yogurt, sauerkraut, and kimchi to improve gut health, and getting regular exercise to improve digestion and reduce bloating. Eating gas-producing foods. Foods that are high in fiber or contain complex sugars can be difficult for your body to digest, leading to the production of more gas in the gut. This gas can then contribute to the smell of your farts. Some examples of gas-producing foods include beans, lentils, onions, and whole grains. Swallowing air. When you eat or drink, you may swallow air along with your food or beverage. This can lead to the production of more gas in the gut and contribute to the smell of your farts. Chewing gum, drinking carbonated beverages, and eating too quickly can all increase the amount of air you swallow. Stress. Stress can have a significant impact on digestion and can lead to the production of more gas in the gut. When you're stressed, your body produces more cortisol, which can slow down digestion and cause food to sit in the gut longer. This can lead to the production of more gas and contribute to the smell of your farts. Certain health supplements. Some health supplements like protein powders and creatine can cause the production of more gas in the gut, leading to the production of foul-smelling farts. This is because these supplements are high in amino acids, which can be difficult for your body to break down. Alcohol consumption. When you drink alcohol, your body breaks it down into acetic acid, which can contribute to the smell of your farts. Additionally, alcohol can cause your body to produce more gas in the gut, leading to the production of foul-smelling farts. This is why people may notice that their farts smell worse after a night of heavy drinking. Smoking. Smoking can lead to the production of sulfuric gas in the gut, which can contribute to the smell of your farts. Additionally, smoking can affect the overall health of your digestive system, leading to increased gas production and other gastrointestinal symptoms. To conclude, farts are a natural byproduct of digestion and are made up of a mixture of gases. Several factors including diet, gut bacteria, and hydration levels can affect the odor of your farts. While occasional foul-smelling farts are nothing to worry about, because farts may not always smell pleasant, they are a natural and normal bodily function. If you're concerned about the smell of your farts or are experiencing persistent gastrointestinal symptoms, it's important to speak with your healthcare provider to determine the underlying cause. So there you have it, folks. The next time you pass gas and clear the room, you can blame it on the sulfur-containing foods that you ate, or your gut bacteria, or even your hydration levels. It's all just a natural part of being human. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos like this one. See you next time.